Mental health equity is critical for all. As a family physician having treated patients with significant chronic disease on the west and south sides of Chicago, I can speak firsthand about their negative experiences in accessing mental health services. I can speak about patients not being able to handle their depression or anxiety in the face of significant stressors that impacted their daily lives. The negative experience of being told to suck it up or to go to the emergency room when they had no mental health clinicians willing to meet with them within a reasonable distance of their home, or when their insurance did not adequately provide them the mental health coverage that they need. Regardless of whether these inequities affected their physical health, and indeed they did, my patients were denied necessary care because our health system is unable to meet their needs. The fight for mental health equity is critical to the fight for health equity. These patients face great harm to this day when indeed others of a different race, ethnicity, sexual orientation, gender identity, or even geographic location could access necessary services to preserve their health. For the patients we serve in VA, the veterans that have served this nation, equitable access to mental health services is a critical component of their care, impacting their long-term outcomes and their ability to live their full and authentic lives. But the need for equity goes beyond any impact that their time in service might have had. Indeed, we recognize the whole person, the whole veteran, must be valued and must be given due attention when care is needed. Mental health equity is health equity because we do not accept an approach of treating the body alone, but we care for all aspects of a veteran's life. As the Chief Medical Officer of the Veterans Health Administration, I am proud to work alongside a team of clinical leaders in this nation who has a mission focused on the well-being, the whole health of our nation's veterans. Mental health equity is necessary so that all veterans receive the care that they have earned and that all Americans can live a full life with the liberties and happiness that our nation protects.